everybody welcome to the first uh <laughs> the first official episode of what is going to be my new youtube channel so the whole goal with this is to essentially take everybody with me to give you some insight into my world so videography motorcycles and uh, essentially the pure chaos that is everything i'm doing right now uh, it's a lot of fun it's uh always a good time I work my ass off and I really just love that I get to do this. So, quick uh, quick insight here. So this weekend is actually gonna be super fun because the girls are coming with me. Say hi puppies. Annabelle's already trying to sneak in on the front seat. She's very sneaky. Um, I've got my lovely dirt bike here, Letty, loaded up. The entire truck bed is filled with gear because I'm actually going to visit my buddy Ben, AKA Dork in the Road in Salem. And we're gonna do some filming for Hippo Hands, for Senna, and I believe for Giant Loop, as well as just get some writing in and start uh, our podcast, which we've been talking about doing for a while. So off we go, road trip time. Welcome to my world. So, in the grand scheme of not wanting to start just another YouTube channel, um, and I promise I'm not looking at the camera, I'm actually driving. One of the things I will say about this, Annabelle, get in the back, come on, get in the back. Other than battling my basset hunt, stay in the back seat, pain in my And then we got everything. Um, why a YouTube channel? and why this type of a YouTube channel. So for a lot of you that know me already, one of the things that I was trying to do previously was do an element of storytelling within some of the incredible footage I got from my year living on the road, or I guess 14 months of living on the road, being able to travel North America, go to Southeast Asia for three and a half months. Um, some of the experiences I had and some of the things that I got to do were just unbelievably cool. And being able to share that with everyone was my intention originally. However, as time went on and I got more and more involved in videography, one of the things that uh, changed for me was I just started getting projects where I was not the focus and I was filming others. So my project will be B40. Um, it's a documentary project that will be released this spring. I've got another documentary project with Public Land Stewards here in Oregon that I'm doing, uh, as well as working for a couple other motorcycle brands. So one of my objectives with building out a second season called my Roadrunner uh, season for YouTube, it ended up kind of going to the wayside because honestly, I just didn't have the time to do it. And I've been so consumed with learning how to film and do better and really build off my skill set that, um, you know, just kind of didn't develop. So now I am here and trying to share a piece of my life, I guess because my life is chaos. Um, I'm constantly on the go. I'm constantly riding motorcycles, doing film projects, etc. And it's amazing. I absolutely love it. Hold please, checking maps. Yeah. Anyway, bottom line is though, I would love to be able to share some of the cool things I get to do as a result of being a videographer, a documentarian, and a storyteller. And the purpose of this new YouTube season, chapter, whatever we want to call it, is purely to give um, anyone who wants to be a videographer, anyone who wants to travel and ride motorcycles, anyone who wants to work with a brand or get into content or whatever else, just to give you an idea of what it actually takes to put the time in, to get the footage, to edit, um, the travel, the lack of sleep, all of those things. Th those are the things we're going to uh, kind of highlight here is just what it takes, how much fun it is, and also just the incredible opportunities you can have as a result of that. All right. So let's check out today's battle station. So I've got my DJI Mavic 3 Pro drone here. I shoot with a Sony a7S 3 camera for video. 
Got some other uh, lovely audio equipment. And then of course I have DJI Ronin that just helps with stabilizing everything. Uh, the usual assortment of GoPro things and Tamsin. And all battery charging. So, hi baby, how are you? Anyway, we've had a relatively uneventful morning. I'm gonna down some coffee, get the bike rolling because this bike does not ever like to start when it's below 65 degrees, which is gonna be hilarious to try and get done. And uh, yeah, we're gonna get out and do some filming today. Definitely gonna get rained on today. Yeah. Look at this beautiful garage, this beautiful man. It's not very organized. Neither of them actually. The man or the garage. It's pretty awesome here. Oh, rain. Yay. All right. Happy Saturday, everybody. So it's about 11 30 right now, and Ben and I are just actually getting rolling because a huge squall of rain kind of came in out of nowhere. And so we're getting a bit of a late start. Um, just we're kind of hoping that some of the rain would clear up so we could do some filming. Um, so we went and got a big ass breakfast and now um, heading out to do some very muddy exploring. There he goes. I'm playing follow the leader today. Anyway. Yeah, so we're off. Um, I have the bike loaded. I had a very lovely little mishap earlier when I was unloading the bike because I am so used to my bike being in a dry environment that I forgot that when metal is wet, particularly with your hitch carrier, uh, the back tire slips and I completely lost the end of the bike, dropped the bike on myself, slammed it into the back of the Tacoma, and now have more cosmetic damage to my brand new truck. So I'm gonna have to order some paint this week and uh, heal the gash on the top of my thigh. Anyway, stoked to ride with Ben today. He's one of my favorite people on the planet. We have so much fun together. And he also, for the record, drives like a motherfucking maniac. So I guess noted for anyone who ever wants to rob a bank, Ben is your getaway driver. Anyway, I'm in a haul to try and keep up with him. Let's go ride some dirt bikes. Woo! Shotgun Creek, pulling into the OHV Expressway right now. Hope we be there soon. So on a scale of one to 10, how excited are you, Ben? Two <laughs> degrees, that's what it feels like. Yeah. I don't know what we're doing, it's, but we're doing it. It's cold and it's raining. But we're gonna ride. <laughs>
Well, Ben and I just got back from a very muddy and fun ride in the rain. Um, I am so cold though, I can't feel my hands. Although actually, my hands are pretty much the only part of me that is a human popsicle, but um, Letty looks pretty, pretty muddied up. I'm stoked, we had a fun day. Got some GoPro filming done, but because of the rain, I couldn't take my Sony out, and it's so overcast that the drone just wasn't gonna work. So unfortunately, we are uh, gonna try again tomorrow and see if we can get a little bit more of that uh, that uh, high grade footage that I tend to go for, but the GoPro should be good for today otherwise. And uh, yeah, we're gonna try and find some food and get warmed up. I am so cold. Everything is so wet, it's like stuck on. There we go. So back from Ben's means the unloading begins and <sighs> gotta get the back unloaded, get everything kind of cleaned up, especially my extra filthy bike which needs bath. So just gonna do the usual sh Sunday shenanigans here, get everything organized, cleaned up, and uh, yeah, start charging gear for the week ahead. <laughs> 